This is Andrew Adams from the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. You're listening to the Three Point Conversion Radio. What's going on? It's your man, Mr. Controversy, Raphael Haynes, here in Atlanta, Georgia, College Park, Georgia. And we're here with Mr. Mister, I'm sorry, Andrew Adams, Tampa Bay Buccaneers cornerback. And um, first off, why is it so important, man, to be here for the children? Um, I just think giving them something, you know, to see, something, something that they can look forward to, that they can, um, you know, strive for, uh, it's just great. I know that helped me when I was younger. So being able to bring out, you know, these these other players and coaches, um, and just having them see them work and work with them, I think that's very beneficial for the kids. And we're here for his camp, by the way. And um, how was it today? Like how, how I know it rained a little bit earlier, but um, how was it? Yeah, you know, the rain kind of uh, shut us down halfway through, but it was excellent. We had a great turnout. The kids were having fun. Um, Everybody was providing energy, effort, hustle. So I think um, it was a great success today. So what is it that you teach or that you want them to take away from this camp? Uh, mostly hard work. Uh, you know, there's no no shortcuts to where you to get to where you want to go. And uh, if you put in the work and, you know, if you build your character day in, day out, then you can achieve what you want to achieve. Now, did you have did you have something like this when you were coming up as far as the camp to go to or anything that? Um, I didn't really go to you know camps like this, okay. but I had um, I had a cousin that actually played at, at the professional level, so my dad was able to kind of bring me around him, and I kind of you know saw it and visualized it. So that's what's up. So last time I talked to him, he was a Philadelphia Eagle, and. Then he, I'm watching TV. Next thing you know, I'm looking at it. He's with the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. How was that experience, man, to um, go with the Buccaneers, get into the playoffs, and then make an impact? I mean, you made an impact. They talking about you on television and everything. How was that? Um, it was awesome. You know, uh, this this uh, NFL world is a business, and so that's the first thing you have to look at. And then. Just being grateful for every opportunity that you know that's thrown your way, and be able to capitalize on every opportunity. Um, so I definitely loved my time in Tampa, and um, I I think I capitalized on that. And of course, there was some news that Tom Brady said he was re- he was going to retire. It was reports, and then he came back and said, "You know what? I'm going to play." So when you heard the news, what was the first thoughts? What went through your mind? They must have gave him the keys to the team, to the organization. <laughs> That's why he came back. <laughs> that was my first thought. <laughs> yeah. That's funny. And how was it playing with him? Did you ever get a chance to talk to him and oh, yeah, he's get my his teammate. knowledge? Yeah. Uh, you know, Tom's a great guy, very smart. He obviously, he's played the game at the highest level uh, for years and still is doing it. So just being able to be around somebody like that is, you know, uh, um, you know a gift. Okay. And before we leave, I always like to have fun. So last year, like I said, you made an impact. But was there a moment? You've been in the NFL already, but was there a moment where you were like, oh, I can't believe this happened? Where you got hit, juked, yeah. anything? When uh, Bruce Arians hit me on the back of the head in the in the playoffs, uh, that's the head coach. Hit me, I was like, man, what is going on? <laughs> <laughs> I would say, yeah. Well, there you have it, Rafael Haynes. My guy, Andrew Adams, Tampa Bay Buccaneers DB. We're in Atlanta, Georgia. Make sure you check us out soon, all right? Thank you. Appreciate it. Appreciate that, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah.